So, um, remember that thumb tells me where, where to put that high pressure, doesn't it? So I want this fork, you know, we've already said this fork from behind. I want to think about my elbow low and the thumb's high. As I'm moving forward, watch what happens to the thumb. So if I, if I come through here, that thumb will turn this way. Now, if I carry on that pressure that way, then the lock's not coming on. So I need to understand that the thumb is pointing downwards, so my pressure needs to be downwards at this point. Yeah. So when, when I do this lock, my, my arm is generally doing that. Okay. Remember it's a break, so when we punch, we normally punch with the elbow down. Yeah, we punch this way and rotate here. So this elbow is always down and here. So when, when I punch it, when I'm coming across this arm, I'll do, I'll do it with the wrong arm, but when I'm coming across this arm, and I'm putting pressure on here, this actually needs to be a strike. So what will happen is my hand, my hand will come in here. Yeah? All right? Now imagine I'm holding the other arm, the other end of that arm. That makes sense? So, so when we do this, we want to think, thumb, we want to step forward. Ideally, with all of our body weight coming through it, because if you're small, like Sienna, you're not going to, you know, if, against someone who's strong, it's not going to work. Okay? So we need to think, thumb pointing out, forefinger is here, elbow is down, I'm going to roll on this tendon that sits behind here. So I'm coming behind the tendon. If, if I get to hit, well, if I punch through, that's going to break. Right? If I don't punch through, and I'm doing this as a lot, and you resist, okay? I'm going to just throw it. Yeah. So what, what, what I'm doing is, is, is like, like, a, um, like a piece of bread with a knife, I'm just going to come back and forth this way. Yeah? So my whole motion will tend to, you know, and, and again, if it's grab, I can rotate here. So, you know, so I'm getting into this one, punch, one, yeah, or grab, two. I'm then applying pressure on the tendon in this cut motion. I'm stepping forwards as I do this here. I'm noticing the thumb is now pointing downwards, so my pressure needs to be downwards here. Make sense? 